Having a handful of awesome knots in your pocket when you're out camping is an awesome tool to have in your toolbox. Today I'm going to show you a knot that the Boy Scouts have been teaching since 1910. I call it the ultimate camping knot. The Boy Scouts, they call it the taut line hitch. All you need is a length of rope. I'm using this uh, reflective rope that you can pick up at most hardware stores. Uh, if you're using this to tie down your tent, reflective rope is awesome uh, because you can see with a headlamp or flashlight at night. So when you cut the end of rope, it, it frays here at the end and uh, it can cause problems for you in the middle of the night, especially if there's wind or a storm. Uh, so what I like to do is be able to tidy up the end of the rope. I use a hand torch and this is a burns matic micro torch here. So what I do is I flick it on and just be able to hit the end. And what it does is it starts to seal up some of those frayed ends so that they don't come unraveled all the way down the end. So this particular rope melts a little bit. What you don't want to do is start pinching it. Uh, I've seen guys where they'll, they'll light the end of the rope and then start pinching it off and they're, they're, they're going to burn their fingers. So um, I'm wearing gloves to begin with, but don't start pinching. The, the torch will do the work for you. So this knot is great to be able to tie down a tent. Uh, the reason that it's great is A, it's tight. It's a great knot. Like I said, it's been taught by the Boy Scouts since the early 1900s. And second, uh, it's able to be adjusted. So if, if the ground gets loose or you're using tent pegs and over the, you know, the course of the night they get loose, you don't have to start stretching them out. You can literally just cinch up the knot. So we're going to wrap this around the tree and we're going to make a cue here. What we're going to do next is wrap the rope through the middle once to make one loop right here. Wrap it around again. So I've got two loops here on the knot. Next, I'm going to make a second cue down through over the top and up through the middle. And then I'm going to pull this knot tight. You want to be able to keep your knots uh, pretty clean so that you don't have a mess on the end of your rope. But now I'm able to slide this knot all the way down to the tree and I'm able to pull it tight. If this were to come loose in the middle of the night or I wanted to undo it, I'm able to just slide this knot up and down to be able to make adjustments. And when I'm ready to pack up and go home, this knot is super easy to take down. This isn't one of those clusters that you get at the end that you see a lot of guys where they start wrapping rope and tying knots and they're sitting there on the ground untying. So I call this the ultimate camper's knot. This is the taut line hitch.